Hello everybody, this is gonna be a real crazy video. So I was in the basement and I found some really, really old stuff. And the first thing I found was, and yes, I'm in the bathroom and there's a reason for that. Air freshener, Florient Pine. And look, just by looking at this can, you could tell that this is old. Like it's probably from, that could even be the 60s, maybe even the 50s. I don't know. There's like, there's a code on the bottom and that's supposed to be a date, but I don't know how to read it. Okay. And then we have, and there's some left. And as you can guess, we are going to try it. Okay. Protein 29 dry control formula by Menon. I didn't know Menon made hairspray. This unique men's hair controls hair control spray that's what they used to call it okay um okay you can't find a date on this but i'm gonna say 70s maybe all right so we're gonna try both of these things out so let me just uh start i should have set my freaking tripod up for this okay i just got the lid off there it is. I don't even know if this is going to spray. I'm doing this left-handed and I'm right-handed. Okay, so shake her up. I'm not letting you see my face because... Oh! It's like... Um... Wait, I gotta spray again. Let me spray upward. Um... It's, it's like... I wouldn't say it smells like pine, but it smells like, I don't know, um, it, like a chemical kind of smell. It's not, actually, wait, yeah, I, I don't know. It's just, it smells like chemicals, like not a bad, bad smell, but I suppose if I were to, someone pooped in here and, and I sprayed this, I would rather smell this than the smell of poop, so yeah. Okay, next up is the Protein 29 Dry Control Formula, the hair control spray. Should I spray some in my hair? Uh, I haven't taken a shower yet, so maybe um, I'll spray a little on the side of my hair. Okay, I don't want you seeing my face, so I'm just going to... Wait, I don't want to put this in my hair. I'm going to, uh, let me just see what it, spray some there on the edge of the sink. Ah, oh, the sink is dusty. Um, okay. Oh, oh my God. It smells like Aquanet. Oh my God. Actually, it's like a fruity kind of Aquanet. It's, it kind of smells good. <laughs> wow. I'm, I'm impressed. Yeah. Okay, well, anyways, um, I may come back at you with some other products that are really old because I, there was more stuff in the basement, so we'll see. Okay, so there are some other really, really old products here in the basement. And the house that I live in, it's, it's really old, so that's, there's like old stuff here in the basement. Um, ben Gay Lotion. I don't ever remember seen Ben Gay lotion before and there's no date on it oh my god this is definitely like maybe 80s possibly 70s oh, I was good I am so good 1987 Woohoo! sunless tanning lotion we'll, we'll definitely have to give that oh 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 I see something else it's 80s 80s look at this LA look stuff ah oh my god look at that design oh that is so cool let's see if we can get a date Oh, 1993, I was off. Okay. That's still cool. And then we got, what's behind here? Aloe Relief Gel. That looks, uh, I don't know. Oh, what's this pink thing? What is this? What is this perfume? Ambush Spray Cologne. Okay. Uh, what else do we got? Did we do that? We did, oh. We got baby powder from ugh, CVS. This looks really old. Yeah, that's old because I remember 
they don't put that like raised writing on the back. And then we got some body powder. This is from Genevieve's. That place went out of business. Uh, I think late 80s. Cashmere bouquet body powder. And the date. We don't have a date on this, but you can tell that's freaking old. So, um, oh, and there's there's one more thing over here. We got static guard. Um, static guard. That sounds familiar. I, I think I remember that when I was a kid in the 80s. I don't, I don't see a date on this. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe distributed by blah, blah, blah. No, there's no date, but that looks old judging by the illustrations on it. So anyway, we'll test out some of these products in a future video and uh, we'll have some fun.